banana. Why are you trying? Why are you trying to hide your name and badge number? I am not. You answer to me. I do not. I would like it if we could uphold the Constitution and allow freedom of press in our courtrooms. Watch out! That's a lawbreaker right here. You like to break the law? Be careful. No, I don't answer to you. I'm free. You're dismissed. I'm not dismissed. Yes, you are. Who the Do we enforce law around here or do we enforce will? Who the fuck are you? Shining your lights in my window! Hey, you need to leave. I don't have You're to. You're dismissed. I'm not dismissed. You are. Actually, I think I'll do a foot control in this area. Go ahead. Don't step on my property. You will be trespassing. Live here. Lower your voice. You need to leave my property. You are, are you trespassing. The fucking yard? You are trespassing. Me. You're going to be going to jail. Follow the law! Say, what's your name and badge Sorry. number? Why are you harassing me? Oh, you didn't? Were you fucking blind the five times you drove by? Which one of you honked at me? Thank you for putting your hands on me. We won't, won't be needing your gloves, sir. We need to take the gloves off. We don't need the gloves. Nobody needs to put their hands on me. And I do not need extorters. Leave my property now! This is private property. property, you are trespassing! Leave it now! You do not walk on this fucking what property! What is your name? On Tuesday, May 5th, in the year of our Lord, 2020, at approximately 5 o'clock in the afternoon, the CPD was, as always, harassing, profiling, and intimidating neighbors over on California Street in the Columbus, Indiana Republic. One of those neighbors happened to witness Jonathan's unlawful arrest the day prior to this incident involving the same corrupt police department. This gentleman was in the private automobile that was pulled over during the traffic stop on May 4th, 2020, the day of the unlawful arrest. Hey everybody, and you're watching The Defenders of Rights. Here we are, it is May 5th in the year of our Lord 2020 at what time? Uh, 427. 4.27 p.m. And uh, we got a few officers over here on uh, 9th and... California. California. California, thank you. Thank you. Well, look who it is. Hey, Britt. Uh, just making sure these guys don't, you know, commit crimes. Uh, two officers on scene. Looks like uh, Sergeant Mitchell. He's a good officer. We just saw him the other night. You know what's going on? Who? Jansen? Okay. Oh, they're looking for him? Okay. So. Oh. Some misidentity. Right. Yeah, that's Sergeant. Uh, Mitchell, or I think it is Sergeant. So, uh, mistaken identity. Stay there. Get that film. So, there's their vehicle right there. One car, two car. You guys, all right? Mitchell, it's Sergeant, right? Okay. Officer Mitchell, it's a Sergeant, correct? Come on now. Just being cordial with you. No reason to act like that. Your department committed a bunch of crimes last night, by the way. I'm not. You're okay. I'm not. It's not for you. There goes Sergeant Mitchell. The other one's on down the way. Don't want to talk. Come on, focus. Hey, there it is. It's the cave. Is it? Yeah, it is. There's the undercover. He passed by. Oh, that's Officer Nolting! Nolting! Hey, buddy! Sackish. That is a tab police vehicle right there. It's a what? We got you now! What's that mean? That means it's police vehicle, so it don't need tabs, but it's got tabs on it. It's illegal? Is that illegal? It's undercover. They don't need tabs. That's it? Yeah. Tags? 
Yeah, like cabs, like, like, like you know, I think the battery just went dead, but got it. No, it's fully charged. Okay, well, it just... So that's undercover. See, because I got that dude here on Chestnut. He'd be riding around. I think he's a, I think he's a, uh, what do they call it? So they're literally cruising around here. Okay, now when you look at a license plate of a police car, right, it don't have to be passed or dated for this year, right? So they're already trying to. See, I thought I thought y'all was the same. I thought y'all was the dude here, like dude, Chestnut. He's right. Well, look who it is. No, no, the police man. They shady as hell, and they're always breaking the law. So, you know, but, police, by the way, did they stop you? No, or they just, they, I mean, yeah, they stopped us asking this guy if I, they asked me if I was Chanston. Okay. But I'm not. They but, didn't search you or anything? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Good, because they can't. Man, I respect you, y'all, for real. Well, we're yeah, trying. Was talk, yeah, I was in jail with him. He was talking about fucking suing them. <laughs> Are you working on that now? They just uh, unlawfully arrested me and imprisoned me last night, so they're really screwed. Yeah. Working on the sworn criminal charges right now. Oh yeah. See, man, I thought y'all was on their team. I'm no, thinking, no. fuck y'all. <laughs> no. I'm two times telling. I mean, if it's a good officer, yeah, I'm on their yeah, team. Yeah, exactly. You know? I mean, but if they're not on no bullshit, but these come police are always on bullshit. Exactly. Man. They are. They are. Hey, unfortunately, I fuck with these dudes. They cool. They cool. Did, hey, they cool. Is that? Do you need anything? No. Okay. Hey, I'm around if you need anything. Okay. Police yeah, last he night. Just did them this yes. Now. They arrested you last night, didn't they? You know, that was me that they had pulled over right there. Oh, really? Oh, really? Yeah, I was right there. Okay, what's That's your what name? I told. My name is T.I. Look. T.I.? Look. Uh, we get mom, pulled dude. over no, down here. I swear to God. T.I. <laughs> look. <laughs> no. We get pulled over down here. Yeah. Right, they tell her they pulled her over for. Uh, on 10th Street and Cottage. On 10th and Cottage, right here, they say uh, uh, improper training in the center lane. Oh, look. really? So they pulled us over. So my man's right here, he come over cool, right? Ah, uh, he ain't saying that he doing it. He just chilling. Well, hey, nigga, they locked this man up for recording. Yeah. No God, shit. My mom. Like, like old boy be riding around recording. No, I swear to God. Look, they telling him. They say this is for officer safety. This is for officer safety. Yeah. All uh, right. Yeah, I get to record. We get to record too. It's a, it's a lot. Now we record. Yeah, now, now we illegal. Nigga, they locked that man up for recording. I swear to God, nigga. Like three more police come up the street. The lady, she like. Lock him up. Yep. I'm like, what? We're arresting this guy. It took nothing but four or five minutes. Man, they tried but, to arrest your wife, chestnut. too. They tried to arrest your wife when you um when they arrested you. Because she um, came back and she was still recording. But she had, uh, when they told her to move, or they was going to arrest her, she had she just went to the street. And they ain't saying nothing to her. That was her house right there. And that was her, yeah. the restaurant say anything, her dad owns anything right there. Anything within plain view. Uh, right? So, so they yes. some bullshit. Hey. Yeah, I was on public property and private property. Plain view. All yeah. plain, you know what I mean? I was there. Yeah, that was me down there. Oh, right oh, what's your initial name? Yeah, the government name they gave you. Ah, uh, down going to my government name. They gave. Me. Oh, Ti. Yeah, that's, that's just your nickname. Nah, my no, name. My name. Tion. 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 Okay, Tion. Okay. T e o. No, T e y o n. T e y o n. Y o n. Okay. Yeah. That's my name. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I saw some. Nice to meet y'all. And I asked the cops. I said, "Damn, I thought we was able to." I said, damn, I thought we was allowed to record TV. the police. <laughs> yeah, and dude, the one dude, he that. told me, nah, the one dude, he told me, he was like, yeah, you can't record the police. Yeah. If they tell you to do something, you got to do it. I told him. Yeah. He wasn't even doing nothing, though. I said, the man was just chilling right there up on his little cap. Mr. Yeah, First Amendment right? Yeah, I locked him up. First Amendment right? Wow, this is a witness to it. Okay. Yeah, that was me right there. Do you, do you, uh, do you live around here? Uh-uh. No? Uh -huh. I'm not, I'm, I'm <laughs> fine here from out here. Hey. What? What? I was up no, in that I black, that black shape crew. Uh, hang on. Back yep, back again. Hey. So we got another officer. I think it's Officer Mitchell again. Circling around, just profiling. Yeah, that's profiling. Tion, he was. Seeing that he was, he was, he, was he asking you? We told Brian, uh, he told Jordan, we told Brian, he said, was y'all playing with paintball now? He said, nah, he said, then it was either you or your brother. I said, or another black motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Is it one of them two or another black dude? You know what I'm saying? So profiling, they're pretty much going around profiling. Yeah, yeah. They, they hate these two. Yeah. Huh? I ain't got a paintball gun. Be careful. Oh. <laughs> Good looking out. Dude. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I can't believe this. Man, Small I told world. I was with a paintball gun, and I was in the house. Hey, 
I'm sorry, I was, I was... I know you were busy. Yeah, yeah, it's taking care of business. And obviously, they're still circling around profiling. So I gotta stick around for a little bit. They do that all day, every day. See, I know they, they do. They don't do nothing to the, uh, to the, uh, Green Street man. All oh, these Columbus man, that people ride, look. They ride around, recording us and shit. Take well, guess what? All of it. We got them. Now. It's time to put back on them. Uh, you know what they, they say when you, when you point a finger at someone, what what you get? You get 60 uh, right back at you. Where's the... Uh, hey, start pointing the camera. That's what I'm saying, though. If the Columbus man... If Columbus By the way, you know about the channel? The dude can ride around here and record people and do all that. My channel? Why y'all can't? Why y'all The Defenders of Rights on YouTube? Okay, you know, something you want me to do? Well, please do. Look it up now. And please subscribe and like. These are videos of our corrupt cops. Right now, I'm working on the one day where they unlawfully arrested me last night. And he, Tion, was there to witness it. We got a huge lawsuit. We have huge lawsuits on these guys. Because they are committing crimes. Who up in a pop? These hands on them. Are they, are they profiling you too? I get harassed every day. I get harassed every day on California. Harassed every day on California. This is California, yes. So this incident happened on 9th Street in California. Which, Huh? We must definitely get harassed every day by the police. Well, I'm staying right here. For, if you guys don't mind, I'm sure Britt don't mind. Uh, nah, you cool. Lexi, like, so you don't mind, they I know. So here are pretty much the victims of uh, officers profiling, and they are very much uh, uh, racist. Man, they pull up, man, they pull up, up oh, on us every day. Definitely. Look, when I had my car out here, I used to have the music up a little bit. It ain't even loud. You can't even hear it outside the car, and, or you can't even hear it now. They used to pull up every day talking about the music too loud. Uh, they pull up like three, four, five times a day. I swear to God. And right every time they come, they come at least three, four, five deep. Of course they do. Every time. For one motherfucker. Look, here they go again. And here's another one. <laughs> so you're right, they are. Yeah, they are very really, really loud fast. You guys are just really picking a fight, ain't you? We know what you do. I'm gonna, we're gonna walk around okay. uh, and follow these guys. Well, have fun. See, just you got to keep up with everybody. Make sure everybody's okay. You know, just love thy neighbor. That's the duty. This is why I, I do my best. Well, that right there, us getting them profiling. Yeah. Wow. And him to be the witness that, oh my gosh, to corroborate. Oh, that makes it even better. That's just. And, and then. they made a beeline for their cars. Yeah. And we'll be over here as soon as we can get here. And sorry about their freaking BS. Howdy, sir. Not recording you, I assure you. What's going on? Uh, just cops profiling. Oh. You know, acting like criminals, so we're just making sure that they don't injure anybody. Oh, okay. Protecting our neighbors. I can't believe they were just sitting right there, hiding. Huh. I, I think they, I think they waiting. were just sitting right there. Yeah, the freaking waiting off, off in the distance, waiting for them to kill them. Hunting people down. That's what they're doing. Undercover hunting people down. Wow. Waiting, they were waiting off to the side, waiting to be cute for the canine. Wow. That's when the officers got, you know, spooked off to the side and then the other two come rolling back by, maybe hoping we'd love to see a gang. But we're still there, so they keep rolling. Literally a freaking gang. Gang of crooks. I mean, I know. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, find a dandy. Bye -bye. I'll see you, later. you better. Okay. Yo. <laughs> you know, for the last quite a few years of my life, I've been good. You know, I haven't been doing, I haven't done people dirty. You know, I've been sticking in my code, helping people when I can. You know, and, doing it now. Uh, many years ago. You know, when I turned my own coat around and myself, my direction around. I was stalked, harassed, you know, by the police for years. And that's, I wasn't doing nothing wrong. And they knew I wasn't doing nothing wrong. But 
they were still harassing me. Still trying to scare me and intimidate me. I got to a point where it's just, you know, when you're that broke and you ain't got nowhere to go, you stop being scared. Scared of? The bullies. The bullies, because they would intimidate you and harass yeah. you. Yes. On a constant basis. You know? Nothing. Getting pulled over. Well, there's, no, there's another explorer. That ain't it. Oh, well. Nope. No, it's gray. Uh, but I, I'd get pulled over seven, eight times in one night, and they'd say I'd match the description of a subject. You know, and they'd make me sit. They knew I walked around all night because I had nowhere to live. And I didn't like staying in shelters and around cry, other cry, you know, people and stuff. And just, and they'd make me sit on a curb when it was cold. And I'd have like a pair of warm-ups on in the wintertime. I have thoughtful of them. You know, in 45 minutes I'd be sitting there waiting for them to run my name when it's like, they just pulled me over an hour and a half ago. <laughs> and then they, oh, you're free to go. Hour and a half later, pull over again. Oh, you matched the description. Yeah. You know, and this would happen night. Time and time again. Hunting you down. They hunted yeah. me down. They did this to me for like six, seven months, trying to get me to get frustrated and leave town. But, you know, it was my hometown. It's where I was from. It's where I was born. Which is where? Spokane, Washington. Spokane, Washington. All across, uh, completely across the United States. And it's happening there. You know, I, it is. I got to a point where I traveled around the United States and it's going on all over the place. What's a real pandemic? Uh, define uh, the question a little more. Uh, What's a real pandemic? Right now we're an alleged pandemic with this COVID-19. What's a real pandemic? I'm sorry, that's not a pandemic. Numbers they falsify, fraudulently put in there, having doctors fraudulently put uh, on the death certificates of people who <laughs> died by COVID. Well, I really they don't know about the COVID, but okay. I mean, uh, the, the whole intimidating and enslaved by bullies. That's the pandemic. Dude, Corruption. It's that, been going on for years, though. Yep, yeah, that's the true you pandemic. Know, but it's, it's, it's as if the government has just been doing it very slowly. Yeah, that's the whole point. And, and yeah, you change things very slowly over time, and yeah. it's like the public does not notice. No. Nope. You but know? They're starting to notice now. Look where America started. Look where it's came to. Look how much it's changed. By the way, there was an officer that drove by. Yeah. He was right up ahead. But yet, you know, so many people believe that we have the same rights that we had then. There's another officer right there rolling up the four-way. Are you going to come up the street? Oh, yep. You're right. And, uh, but, but when you look at our rights, when you look at how officers treat people, and what, the way they talk to people, and the way they assert themselves on you, it's more of an intimidation thing. You know, on the yes, side of the car it says to protect and serve. Yep. You know, some officers, yeah, they're, when they joined up, yeah, I'm sure they did do, want to do it to protect and serve and to help and. But then they started following orders, not the law. Yeah. And, and the way things with codes and everything have changed, everything around. Look up actual rights and what they defined and what they meant when they came out in the nice. Precisely. And then look well, up the true. codes, you know, and, and what their definition is. It's not the same as the rights. They're turning things around. Yes, they are. Just you like know, when you make laws fit both ways, you make it to where you can charge anybody with anything well, at any given time. That's just it, the hierarchy of law, which is uh, indicated in the Indiana Code. Uh, Article in, 1, Section 1, Dash 1, Dash 4, Dash 2, or 3. Yeah, they, uh, they clearly state the laws governing the Indiana Republic are the Constitution's. Take a look. Look at my face. Yeah, they're trying to figure out who you are, I bet. <laughs> Is that undercover? No. I don't think so. I own. So they're waiting on us to walk back. They're waiting on us to walk back. There's a uh, Ash. That's Ash. Ashley. They're waiting on us to walk back so they can. Hi guys. Bueno. They're waiting on us to walk back so they can go back there and start harassing everybody. That's, that's guaranteed. I guarantee that's what they're doing.
Music licensing be imagined. Music licensing, we imagine.